Maybe in the future, if I stay here long enough, we can do some more shit. Dude, and who, who knows? We have so much content back here, dude. We, we got we got episodes for, for years. <laughs> yeah, uh, uh, honestly, honestly, though. I mean, there's um, so much crap we can play. Like, I really I really need to, I mean, shit, just right off the bat, I'm thinking about Bioshock. Bioshock yeah, something. yeah. Whenever, whenever, whenever uh, you were, uh, we were talking about uh, playing something, you brought up Bioshock, and I was like, Bioshock. Hmm. I don't know. That's, that's why, why, why Bioshock? Why, why, why would that come to your head? I don't know. Is, is I, it, it, wait, it, wait, is it because you haven't finished it? That and and for, it's just something about it. It's just there's something that, that that draws me to that game. I think it has a lot to do with the story and stuff, you know. Like I'm, I'm curious about Rapture City. I'm curious about the Big Daddies and stuff because I don't know, I don't know a lot about the lore. Oh, dude, Big so, Daddies are fucked up. They're, so they're pretty like, cool. So it's like I, I want to, like I'm actually legitimately drawn to it, but it just like it, I just forget about it sometimes. And I, yeah, I could probably beat <sighs> Bioshock in two days, roughly eight hours. That's not bad. Eight hours, that, I, I, I'd that's say. That's a nice meaty session, right? Yeah, there, and you know? uh, and that's me, like you know, doing my speed or anything of like move, <laughs> get out of my way. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, but nah, dude, B Bioshock One, dude, it's where it's at. Um, uh, I uh, I uh, played it for one of my friends, and uh, she she quite enjoyed it. Nice. Um, nice. not not so much too. Maybe because we went like straight out of one into two okay but uh but uh i like two it's just basically one but you're a big daddy would you would you ever uh would you ever get fallout four chance me on, on the channel uh no never really yeah not okay. uh, not not fallout on the channel uh, me and twitch uh discussed fallout new vegas on the channel multiple times Dude, but because that's... but like but like if we did fallout new vegas uh it's literally just a knockoff of um Mike Burntfire, who uh, who does uh, uh follow um like content N New Vegas content oh, to okay. this day, wow! Like they're still they're, they're st they still do Fallout episodes and 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 and, uh, and literally what it is I think I told you the premise but uh one's named Mike and one's named Zach right mm -hmm. uh, and Zach is the dude who's actually playing and uh Mike is is like funny um companion um like like friend that, that he talks to but inside the game like they act like zach's the main character like the like the main protagonist and yeah. then they have an npc that follows him around and mike acts like he's that npc and like <laughs> so cool. so so basically they act like they're playing multiplayer but you know it like it's just like uh yeah. like like an act to show the whole time but it it works out and it, it, it's that's hilarious it's that's... it's a it's a super good show and uh it's, it's a super good setup that's pretty cool yeah that's, that's yeah. something different but i mean like you know if you were to play through you're not doing something like that you're just playing it i mean but i mean then i, I get what you're coming from though yeah but I like mean... but like if uh if you were to do you know a fall in new vegas series you're like talking about a hundred plus episodes like that's honestly uh, like a hundred plus episodes maybe more that's than true. that if like if you were to do like a hundred percent of that game and like every mission every side mission. oh man <laughs> then you would have like almost two years of, of episodes because <laughs> Because uh, 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 typically you, you would release like one episode a day. Yeah. Um, but 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 I I have been having an itch to play Fallout Four because I'm watching Mike Burnfire, uh, 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 play it. And but like, I want to play it with mods. Yeah. Like that's what. That's probably makes what it look at. interesting. Is because. Um, I know, uh, I know there's like texture mods for it and stuff like that. No, dude, gun mods. Yeah. Add yeah. in more guns. So it's, 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 it's some more realistic shit. Definitely. But yeah, dude. Uh, I, I, Power Shock, maybe. Uh, dude, Fiddle Frame. Oh, definitely. I, I was low key. I saw Fiddle Frame and definitely. I was like, it'd be funny if it did Fiddle Frame. I think that, that'd be and funny. That, and that's one I'd like, I've never really gotten into and never touched. So yeah, and it, then, it'd, it'd, and it'd, then, it'd nice. and then originally I, I actually planned to do uh, RE3 because I never, I never beat RE3. <laughs> no, yeah. I, yeah, yeah, I never beat RE3. And then I was going to segue into me playing the remake. I asked you about uh, Overkill, right? Yes, you did. I really think that'd be a good episode overkill one of your favorite games ever yeah, exactly it, it definitely falls on that top 10 for me and it's a really weird pick to have on uh, on your top 10 list is uh, is how by the way house did over uh, overkill overkill yeah more specifically is what yeah. i'm talking about it, it's just it's a one-off game it's a weird game but i don't know why yeah i think i think um 
uh, Game Grumps uh, played the typing a did version of uh, how, of Overkill. Oh wow! I didn't know they had that. Version. Yep, that's fucking nuts. They 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 uh, they sure do. Wow, I, I like to check that out. I played Type Into the Dead once, and it was pretty cool actually. I'd like to I like to get that set up for my Dreamcast. <laughs> Dude, yeah, it'd be cool. But uh, I think I think I think that actually does it. We're just sitting here reminiscing on on random shit. Uh, so that could be a whole episode. Just us talking about what games to play. Yeah, 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 yeah. We can literally like, man, you uh, you, uh, you get a stack of like cute games or like miscellaneous stuff that you uh, uh you, you can pick right here. You can just point out one, you know, Left 4 Dead. Yeah, that, exactly. Um, I was about to say Left 4 Dead. Man, Dead Space, RE4. You could spend all day talking about that. Um. Mm-hmm. I, uh, any, uh, I, I no more say, heroes. Yeah. I want to say Umbrella Chronicles is in there somewhere too. <laughs> yeah, chocolate. Man, I never realized. Uh, so, so remember how I was like, I was like, oh man, I love, I, uh, I love uh, Ada's costume and uh, mercenaries. Yeah, yeah. Right. That that's her costume in uh, Umbrella Chronicles. <laughs> oh, I didn't know. <laughs> you, did, did you realize that? <laughs> no. Yeah, that 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 blew, that blew my mind. That's hilarious, man. I got a couple of one-offs in there too in that stack. Like I think there's Ninja Blade. You ever you ever, you ever played Ninja Blade? I know of Ninja Blade. <laughs> I know the, of the Ninja QTE Blade. like Ninja Guy knockoff. And I, oh yeah, and I got that 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 Ninja Guy Nyaiba too. That'd be another interesting one to check out because I've been wanting to go back to that game. I remember yeah. that, I remember that game being kind of weird. Yaiba. Yaiba, yeah. That that it's a like a spinoff of, of Ninja Guy. The dude like story is the dude got his ass kicked by Ryu. Oh my he, god, now, that's he, sad. What he, the hell? He wants revenge. He's from like a like an opposing ninja clan or something like that. So now he wants revenge. So like he's got like a cybernetic arm or some shit like that. And it's it's. I'm pretty sure I I, I is it uh, is it like black and red? No, no, it's it's in color. Like the, the the I think the cover art might be like black and red. But uh, like if I showed you, you'll you'll yeah. you'll recognize yeah. it. You'll be like, yeah, oh yeah, yeah I, I, I remember that crap. So. But but now but now whenever whenever uh, I sit here and play ga- a, a game for show like we go on some weird games sometimes or yeah like, r- really really unique art picks like uh like like our taste are really kind of bounces around to super high quality it's just weird things that weird just kind of exist shit, man we're we're all over the we're all over the place like perfect example would be e- Evil Zone for me I mean that that game is like really garbage but it's good like the aesthetic of it you know the anime aesthetic oh and, and um, the music remember you know we were jamming to the soundtrack not too long ago over here and we were just like just freaking out over how just how high quality the fucking soundtrack was but like the game mechanically and everything like that it's pretty trash yeah dude it's <laughs> so fucking trash for evil zone uh, 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 for those who don't know, Evil Zone, I'll put a picture up uh, here for you yeah. for Evil Zone. PS1 fighting game. Yeah, fantastic. Oh my god. It's so stupidly good it's soundtrack. So fucking crazy. Also, too, like, just like a super like, good premise for like multiple characters from different universes. Fr- from, from their own shows. From, there you like, go. Like, yeah. like, 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 every character has like their own show genre. Once, like, a cool, like, Shonen antagonist once like you're like farting them type hero. Yeah. Once you're magical girl. <laughs> one uh once you're like basically all um, the anime tropes um, rolled uh, into one. What's uh, what's uh, what's the dude in the suit's name? Oh, Kea. Oh uh, yeah, Kea. Yeah. Uh 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 he's, he's actually a psych a psychic psychic priest or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Just fucking cool like premise. Like I said, nothing but anime tropes just rolled Old into, school anime tropes. The cool anime tropes. Exactly. Exactly. And and it's it's it, but it's so trash though. <laughs> That's the one thing yeah, you, well, like, you well, can't like, ignore like, about it. What if you like freshly play the game and you're like just like playing for fun? Like, like it's pretty cool and pretty fun. Yeah. But once you actually like learn the game and learn how to properly fight and everything like that, you can just literally like get anyone yep. with Almost like any character. Anybody, yeah. Yeah. It's funny how every character is basically the same character. <laughs> There's no different in like move sets or anything like that. And, and that game had a lot of potential, but it just it just didn't do it, I guess. You know. And it's uh, it, uh, and it's funny. Anytime that I see someone play it, like uh, whenever I saw Maximilian uh, 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 play it, because he never knew about it was on, and it was uh, it was like a video that, 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 that that's like a year or two old. Really? Yeah. Wow, I didn't know. I didn't know he played that one. Yeah, 
Uh, and uh, and I was like I was I was like let me let, let me see what Maximilian thinks of Evil Zone and he's like and he's like you know what this game's kind of bad but it's also really fun and I was like exactly that's it right there. He gets it. <laughs> it's like thank thank you Maximilian I know you never see it but thank you for confirming um, what I've always yeah known. <laughs> and then and then plus two uh, 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 he was talking about you know the soundtrack and like 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 the core premise of it but but also yeah. too he was playing the boy. Um, Dan Zabar, D- oh, Dan okay, Dan yeah. Zabar, whatever his name is. Yeah. That that dude's hype. That, Super hype. Th- yeah, yeah, yeah. Th- that is my boy. Plus two, his armor, his suit. It's um, so uh, 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 also the fact that um, whenever he like loses a round, uh, his armor. Gets- His face would be exposed. Battle damage is so badass. Like all the characters, they have like a little like a oh uh, damage phase, damage phase, which yeah. is like you know not typical for fighting games or like yeah. games uh uh for, for that time period for to, that age yeah yeah you don't yeah to have a detail on their models like that because you know that's a lot of work mm-hmm. to make it you know not only look good but also to work because yeah. uh, shit like that might break your game <laughs> ex- 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 especially back in the day like that. Yeah. It, uh, it'll destroy your shit. But like I said, perfect example. You know, we're, we're our tastes are all over the place. I mean, yeah, um, I mean my anime trash that I uh, put on the channel on the occasion. <laughs> um, playing playing Uh I have uh, re- really cool Metroidvania, dark like, re- like a cool dark goth aesthetic. Yeah, I think you told me about that one. There's a lot. There's a lot of those games. That, that genre is blowing up so much, man. Dude, there's like there, uh, there's like three Metroidvanias I have my queue right now that I want to play for the channel. Really? But I'm like, nice. man, I should. I uh, this channel is slowly gonna turn into the Metroidvania channel. Shit. It's up. like, oh, boy, what are you doing today? I'm playing another Metroidvania. That's not, it's that's, probably gonna be sick. That's not a that's not a bad idea. Shit, I'd watch something like that. Shit, I, I love the shit out of Metroidvania games. Like I'm always looking for a new one to play. Yeah, yeah, and like, and like, that's what I tell myself too. It's like, man, you know, I get that, you know, I like Metrovanias, but it's not my fault that they're so fucking good or so fucking fun. I think, uh, like, I don't, I don't know how how you're gonna be able to, to to play it, but I really do want you to play Phantom Dust, or or yeah, Fan, is it Phantom Dust or Elysium Dust? There you go. That that was a real slept on. Uh, Indie game that came. I gotta, out. I gotta like. Well, if it's an indie game, the PC came, man. It came, yeah. It, it, it's probably definitely gonna be on Steam. Uh, but it came, it came on a 360. That's that's where I first found it, and I, I downloaded it. And, and I've never beaten it, but it, it's a pretty damn solid game. Like, oh, like uh, a, how do you spell it? It's a hack, hack slash. Uh, Elysium. I think it's E L Y. But no, yeah, that, that that's one I, I wanted to show you. I mean, not really in the Metrovania vein, but it's a hack and slash. Oh. Yeah. 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 No. 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 You. Are uh, you showing me this before? I, I went back and played it recently, and I'm not. I just like, like man, this game's actually. Now, uh, pretty, one thing, one good. thing that I've been wanting to cover is a uh, is a dish uh, a dishwasher. Ooh. Do that as a retrospective because no one's talked about it recently. Yeah. And uh, because the, because like every like generation, you know, it's like typical to bring up certain games that kind of faded out yeah. and it's good to bring those back into yeah. um modern day light every so often just to you kind know like, get like a double take you know yeah like hey you know just like just like you told me about with the uh ps2 castlevania games you said there's a couple youtubers actually going back and saying hey are these games really bad as they say they were mm-hmm. and, and then and then they go back and they like really enjoy them like yeah, like uh they actually uh, actually take like like i said take that second look yeah and, and uh really... the most recent example of that was um matt mcmuscles he played curse of darkness nice. uh and he's always booted it up and never actually like played it and beat it but uh he did like a small like 30 minute episode of it and he was like you know this is like kind of all right but as I'm playing, I'm kind of like really enjoying it, <laughs> and he, and uh, and uh, and uh, and he was like, he was like, yeah, I think I, 
I think I might get seen this uh, after before it hurt. <laughs> and I was like, yeah, that's what's up. That's and it, and uh, and I I I do hope that he uh, managed to finish that, even though he does like have a busy schedule, right. you know, with with, uh, with this channel and whatnot. But really good game. Good Curse of Darkness, and uh, uh, I, I even mm -hmm. thought about doing a uh, video for Curse of Darkness, but once again, I had to get a PS2 memory running, and and I don't feel like, well, you know what? I, I think our next one might have to be Lament of Innocence. I think we might have to do it. Lament of Innocence, yeah, Castlevania back to back. Um, I mean, like I said, oh, dude, we, uh, we could download it on the PS3, never mind. Oh, yeah. big brain for like five bucks yeah heck yeah i mean i got the disc i mean you know we oh yeah that's right we uh, we got the spider-man ps3 man we can we can <laughs> slap PS3. it in the ps2 disc bro bro this ps3 is just it's i'm, I'm surprised that thing is it's a dinosaur yeah man. It's, it's seriously a dinosaur but it's still kicking and it, it's already i've already been in once to get repaired and, and since, uh, that was for hard drive or like a loose piece like that? Yeah, it's something, uh, I can't remember exactly what it was. It had something to do with the solder on the motherboard. Uh, the, the solder that Sony was using was, was kind of like jank. So uh, they, they, they they knew about it too. So they... they, they <laughs> it was they, like a company they, recall? Yeah, they pretty much they did. And, and they, they gave everybody the option to send, send them in and they resoldered it for, for everybody. And that shit, I remember they had my console for, a, I want to say a couple months. And I was getting very impatient there at the end. Did there, you uh, low key expect not to get it back? Cause I sure as fuck would. Oh no, I, I was, I was pretty sure I was gonna get it back. I, I trusted Sony, you know. I'm, I'm, had faith in that company back then, you know. Uh, I and still have faith in Sony. They came through. I mean, look, years later, this thing is still kicking. So, <sighs> dude, they, they did dude, it's my still, it still blows my mind because like, like, the, like I'll, I'll be with you. That that PS3 version, fucking, oh, dude, it's rocky. It sucks. Yeah, it does. It does what I mean, but that backwards compatibility. You can't man, beat it. You can't fucking beat it, that's, man. That's that's where it's fucking at, man. I've been I've been using that shit for years to play PS2 games, PS1 games. Like I have original hardware, but I don't know. I just like I like using it because well, I guess because it's it, it's um, oh, fuck. I mean it does, not not versus oh I mean yeah versatile but uh, uh easily accessible exactly. You don't have to uh, you know have your fucking exactly um, you got everything in one so. av cables yeah. you know and yeah and it's, it's hdmi too so it's like you know i mean yeah and then uh some some modern ATVs don't even have av cables in the back that's true which is uh i can't sucks, believe that man. but uh, that's, that's so that's so fucking crazy and even the ones that do you hook up anything does uh, this tv have uh, av cables in the back uh i think it just has component but i mean you can still use av yeah with, with that component output which yeah it does suck man like like I do, I do, uh, I like my, my other Sony because it has like a bunch of fucking uh, inputs, you know, VGA, component, S video, HDMI, optical out. <laughs> I'm like, man, that's, just, that, that's, the, and I want another TV like that, a modern TV like that, but you can't find that shit. Anymore. No, because they all just take getting, all that shit out. It's phased out. Now you got to buy converters and shit. Adapters. And adapters and stuff. And yep. Like, oh. Splitters all that crap it's like give me a break guys. and then and then and then whatever your like desk or whatever uh you're, you're, you're gonna on, just filled with all types of small devices <sighs> fuck that dude somebody had to make a tv with the metro the retro gamer in mind <laughs> like seriously <laughs> the gamer tv exactly get like, yours today like it, have it like you know be super high quality you know just have got that maxed out refresh rate everything you need right there. you would question your uh your plan of existence due to how crazy this refresh rate is <laughs> right. you'd be like oh man i look over for the tv and everything looks so slow Shit, it, it, <laughs> take my money right now man Shit, I, I definitely would need something like that i mean i'm always trying to find ways looking up shit on youtube like you know do it yourself stuff you know how to you know make the most visually of your classic consoles and it's it's been kind of a struggle having to buy this little device or buy this you know this other little device and stuff and it's like I mean sure there's there's they are there are retro consoles where there are HDMI you know outputs in it and stuff and they take multiple cartridges but it's like I, I, I don't know why I don't go for those I still want original hardware for some reason well I still... yeah yeah but like literally those 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 like releases are literally just like shelf knickknacks yeah yeah that's true. And then there's also, you know, the whole, like, screen of, like, why get anything retro when you can emulate it all? 
Yeah, that's that's another true too. But uh, like me, I like I like to have, have a, a nice collection, man. Have a physical collection, and I'll emulate too. I'm not I'm not you know opposed to emulation. Like emulation is where it's at as, as far as preservation goes. I mean, yeah, 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 for sure, man. That's a video big, game uh, preservation needs to exist. That's a big thing right there, especially for me. Yeah, there's a th- th- there's a huge society out there, you know, emulating. Oh, yeah. Um, I think I uh, uh, I think I told you, but uh, um, for the for the uh GameCube. Uh, emulator they even like went out of their way to emulate the um uh the like ports or like the uh like the stupid useless like game boy adapter oh yeah, yeah stuff I know, I know what you're talking about the peripherals and stuff like that yep yeah that's what like cool. like 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 people go out of their way to pr- preserve this like really niche and useless stuff but <laughs> you know it's like there's still a market for it you know yeah, yeah. People still will still buy stuff like that. You know, it's a, it's a, it's a history. It's a, yeah. it's a, it's a culture in itself. You know, why not? Straight up, straight up, man. Oh God. So yeah, I guess we've been going on carrying on a little too long. We, yeah, we, I'm gonna have to figure out something to put in the background. We sit <laughs> for the for the rant, whether whether it's just replayed footage of uh, Richter running around doing something or uh, shit. Just put like a slideshow of like you know Castlevania artwork and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. And have them fade in, fade out. You know. Yeah. I mean, especially for Symphony of Night, because I told you I love that. Yeah. Uh, I'll I'll probably do that then. I'll, but, I'll I'll just probably play like one of my favorite Symphony Night songs, and then uh, uh, what I'll probably do is uh, I'll cut it and be like, all right, uh, yeah, uh, uh, this is bonus footage of just like random rant. Just, um, just bullshit. Yeah. So if you want to watch, you can watch it. Blah blah. Uh, you want to go ahead and uh, sign sign us off? Yeah, for the second time. Yeah. <laughs> uh, well, well, well. I, uh, uh, I, I try to sign off, but uh. <laughs> yeah, we kept going on. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for us uh, this evening. Uh, this is a show uh, with your host and Bolt uh, for Reductus TV, and uh, we're out like a trout. All right, uh, check us out next time in the next episode for whatever we upload. See ya. <laughs>